Five years ago, the Yelp for Help program was dedicated in the memory of a dog named Ronald at the Ormuncto SPCA. The manager, Tracy Marcatulio, has more information on how this unique charity was started. We had uh, a seizure of um, Pomeranians uh, through the New Brunswick SPCA. They um, were in really bad condition and when the New Brunswick SPCA went to um, get the dogs, the owner of the dogs tried to kill them. And sadly, several of them he did succeed. Um, some of them he didn't, but Ronald was one of the dogs that he tried to kill and didn't succeed. Um, he did hit him in the head with a hammer and Ronald had a broken skull and couldn't stand and he had a whole bunch of medical issues. So it was, it was in memory of him. The program has funded many animals since Ronald, with surgeries ranging from amputations, removing infections, and orthopedic surgery. It has also helped in the funding of many dogs seized from puppy mills in northern New Brunswick. The newest patient at Ormuncto's SPCA is a nine-week-old kitten named Austin, who was found at Base Gagetown with his mouth cut open by a riding lawnmower. Animals like Austin here are part of the SPCA's program Yelp for Help. It's an organization that helps raise money for medical treatment and foster care during their recovery so they can soon be adopted. Tony Reed is a volunteer at the Ormuncto SPCA and helps with the recovery of the animals. I donate to Yelp for Help through the Canada Helps website, which is a secure website. You just have to make sure that you uh, and sh make sure that it's for Yelp for Help, um, or you can find it through the Ormuncto and Area SPCA website, or you can come into the shelter. This is Austin, and this has been Ashley Egner reporting for St. Thomas Journalism.